This is the Earth Science Classroom. Welcome back to the channel. This video is in the Oceanography playlist and we're looking at water and what water is as a physical or chemical entity on this planet, a piece of matter, a compound made up of different water molecules and how this plays an important role in the function of our planet and a good starting point to investigate oceanography as a subject. So as a great starting point to this subject, this study of the oceans, water itself covers 71% of the Earth's surface, and of that 71%, 96.5% of all water on Earth is stored in the oceans. And these very large, basically think of them as these very large bathtubs that sit on solid ocean crust and link up with the land and the continents at the coastlines. So in terms of chemistry, water is an amazing water molecule or compound. Now water is a compound which is a mixture of different atoms, different atoms, different quantities joined together. And it's also the single water molecule which as you see here from the diagram contains oxygen and two hydrogens. Now the hydrogens are connected to the oxygen uh, through its dipolar, different electro charges of the negative oxygen with the positive hydrogens and it's a 105 degree angle between the hydrogens which is pretty consistent and there is a strong covalent bond between the hydrogen atoms and the oxygen atoms and that is where you are sharing the electrons that keep the, the bonds strong and this keeps the water molecule as a very unique and strong uh, molecule in chemistry on Earth. Now it's also unique in the way that it can exist in all three states of matter, solid as ice, liquid as water, and as a gas as water vapor. So based on the amount of electrostatic bonds that are connecting the hydrogen with the other oxygen, so connecting two water mo molecules together through a weaker electrostatic bond, which is between the positive hydrogens and the negative electrons. But the actual water molecule itself is covalent and the between the two water molecules to make water as a compound you have a weaker electrostatic bond which is going to form a cohesive and sticky nature to the water and create what's called surface tension and also create a large high heat capacity whereby water is encouraged to be in the liquid form uh, more so than both gas and ice. So besides the amazing chemistry of the water molecule, water itself as a compound is a fantastic universal solvent and can dissolve a lot of different ions and solutes into its mixture to create difference in density and latent heat, heat capacities, and really form the basis of our physical oceanography and how the chemistry of the oceans works. And this will be done in later videos in this playlist.